Now from WMAR 2 News, Maryland's most accurate forecast. Well, if you've been thinking about the month of April and how damp it's been, it's not just your imagination. Whenever we take a look at the stats for the month, yeah, we've already gotten three and three quarters inches of rain so far this year. And just so that we can put that into perspective, we should be at about two and a half. So that means that we're already about an inch or so above what we should be for this time of the month. And unfortunately, more rain is eventually into the forecast. We're tracking another low pressure system that's going to be trekking across the country. It's going to get close to us Saturday evening, but I think that most of the day on Saturday will be dry and quite nice. But as we head into the evening, that's where the rain chances will start to increase, expecting the heaviest rain to push into the area after around midnight. So if you have plans for Saturday, being outside, giving you the green light to do it. We're going to start off the morning at 8 o'clock in the lower 50s, upper 40s, depending on where you are. As we get into the afternoon, the things really start to warm up. So if you were thinking of maybe taking a walk in the park with the wife and the dog or maybe having a picnic, it's a good day to do that. 63 degrees almost around the block here, a little bit warmer when you head south. And as we get closer to the 6 o'clock hour, the numbers will slowly start to cool. We'll end back into the 50s as we get closer to the 10 to 11 o'clock hour. Temperatures falling back into the 40s as we head into the overnight hours. Now, in terms of precip, I have a couple of spotty showers at nine o'clock look at the map not a lot of green there so i'm not expecting this to be a widespread event at nine o'clock but as we head into the overnight that warm front will lift through and it'll start to shift some of that moisture towards us and as we get into the early morning hours that's when some of the heaviest of the rain and that's some deeper reds there so that's letting us know that's going to be some heavier precept movement through the area going to be tracking that through the afternoon so sunday unfortunately is the weekend loser because even though the numbers are going to be a little bit warmer and i think that we'll see some strong winds on Sunday that's going to blow some of that warmer air into the area. Some locations could get into the upper 60s. It's going to be a bit damp out there, cloudy with showers on and off throughout most of the day. Here's that seven day forecast where, of course, the weekend is in view. 64 and mainly dry for Saturday. Showers move in on Sunday and they linger on Monday, drying out on Tuesday. And that's another good day in the forecast to be out and about. If you were maybe looking to get out in the yard and do some work in the garden, 65 degrees is quite pleasant. Chance of showers and storms returns to the forecast on Wednesday. And I'm tracking the lingering rain chances as we head through Thursday and Friday.